Well, hi there, Pluckers. I'll have a finger again with you. Thanks indeed for joining me for another guitar lesson. This one is a request I've had for another oldie but goldie all the way back to the 1960s uh, by a band called The Searchers who were very big in the UK in the uh, 60s and had a very big hit with a number called Needles and Pins which is what this lesson's all about. Okay, So I'm in standard tuning, no capos as you can see and I am doing it in the same key that The Searchers originally recorded this in. Okay, So without more ado I'm going to make a bit of a fool of myself now and sing you this song all the way through <laughs> and then I should break it down and show you how it should have been played <laughs> so here we go <clears throat> Let's get to it then. The, the iconic introduction, okay? So um, basically it's an A chord and I'm doing a strum, a couple of strums down. So, so okay. And then take pinky off the second string. Okay, so. And come back up and put the finger back in. Okay, so. Down stroke with it off, okay. So it's on twice, off, up stroke, back on again, down stroke, up, right? So, and then off, down stroke, and then put the pinky up to the third fret on the second string, then down to the second position, first, second fret on the third, second string, off back on again. Okay, so it's and then and then off with it off once and then start all over again. slowly if I can. Okay, when you 
speed that up, it should sound something like this. Okay, that goes into the song, obviously, right? So then it goes into the verse, which is A and F sharp minor. F sharp minor is basically a bar chord, second fret, uh, fourth fret of the fifth string with the third finger and pinky on the fourth fret of the fourth string. Or you can just bar the first three strings with the first finger like that or like that. So it comes out of the intro. I'll just do the intro relatively slowly and then we'll go into the verse. Okay, so it's I saw her face, was it face, that's your minor, and I knew, I had to back to the A, that's your minor, help me to begin, now we've got to do the riff again now, now it goes, but still they begin, needles and your minor, now to a D, da 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 da, yeah, start on the, uh, to the second verse, A, okay? So we just go through that whole verse again uh, a little bit faster this time without any uh, stops, okay? So, uh, so after the... Uh, I saw her today, I saw her face, because of the face, I don't know, my eye. to go up here and play a bar chord on the seventh fret bar and we have to do that so barring of the ninth fret on the fourth third and second strings with the third finger and we're not really interested in the first string or the second string really just the first six five four and three really so it says like a power chord really okay so and what you have to do is you have to slide that down one fret at a time from this fret. So it's starting on this bar on the seven, six, five, four. Okay, so it's like, okay. So it goes where it goes there. Pin, pin, pin. Goes so it goes uh, that bit again. So, uh, where are we? Uh, just so please uh, get down on her knee. Then it goes into D, uh, yeah. Okay, and it goes into this middle section where it goes, uh, why can I stop and tell myself to be B bar chord, seventh fret, major, B major. So it's, why can I stop and tell myself B wrong, I'm wrong, so wrong. Down two frets to the A, fifth fret. Why can I stand up? Down one more fret to, a, to um, G sharp. Wrong. Okay, so we're now on the fourth fret bar chord. So it starts off on the D or C sharp in this particular key. So it goes slide down from the E chord to C sharp. Why can I stop? Tell myself B wrong, I'm wrong, so wrong to A. Why can't I stand up to G sharp? Okay, so 
Okay, and it goes into the final verse, which is in a C sharp. Okay, so it's that chord, that chord you ended up with when you did the rundown. That chord. Okay, fourth fret bar chord, and barring the fourth, third, and second strings on the sixth fret. Okay, so let's do that bit again. It comes into that. Uh, comes into so we feel those needles and pins hurt me, hurt me. We can ask them until the cell can walk so long, so long. Why can I stand up until the cell can walk? Because I saw her today, I saw her face, it was a face I loved. Now that is B flat minor. So it's A minor, up one fret and put a bar on the first fret, okay? B flat minor, okay? So that goes from D, uh, from C sharp or D flat, whichever we want to call it, same chord. So it goes because, uh, because I saw her today, I saw her face, it was a face I, B flat minor, and I had to bleed back to the C sharp, la 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 C, B flat minor, now this is probably the hardest part of the song. You have to play the riff, the beginning riff, with the, with the bar chord on it. So it's that chord that you were playing there, but you have to make up the instead of playing the bar on with the third finger, you have to use three fingers and do it like an A chord, but with a bar on the fourth fret. And you have to do the sort of riff, the iconic riff bit. Okay. To do that, okay, which is quite difficult. So it's like you start off with a strum on the chord down to the second string, okay, take the pinky off, back on again, off, up to the suspended part where you've gone from the from your bar, it's the third fret from your bar, on the, it's on the uh, seventh fret pinky on the second string, so it's Back down to the second on the sixth fret on the second string, off, and back onto the sixth fret. Okay, so okay, and you have to if you want to play that riff, that's the only way you're gonna do it. Okay, so from the end of the bit where it goes, um, uh, where it goes, uh, begins as you feel those needles the B flat minor and now we're F sharp major second fret bar chord now to the fourth fret bar chord see G sharp okay so that's that verse is D because I uh, because I saw two D I saw a face it was a B flat minor and I knew I had to go back to the C sharp B flat minor Another riff coming up. Back to the B flat minor. F sharp major, second fret bar chord. So G sharp major, fourth fret. And then you have to do this riff all the time now. Needles and pins, this is the ending. Needles and pins. So that's the ending, that's how the whole song ends, okay? So after so let's just go from the beginning of the C sharp uh, verse um, where it goes, we'll just go through it slowly. Because I saw her today, I saw her face, B flat minor, I saw her face, B flat minor, 
Tam, PP flat my earth in Tam, a sharp major, the sacred bark order, and to a full fret bark order. Oh, needles and pin. Three times. Needles and pins. Okay. I'm going to end up on that one, okay, on the D flat, okay. C sharp. So it's, you have to do three of those at the end. So it's, uh, it comes out. Oh, needles and pins. Needles and pins. Needles and pins. And that's how it finishes. Okay. Well, that's a bit tricky that bit. I've got to say. Yeah, certainly does it doesn't do much good for your wrist. <laughs> okay. Thank you for watching and hopefully that makes sense to you. Uh, any comments, let me know. Bye bye for now. See you in the next video.